My queen, the lord, my, my lord, the queen is dead. That's, I can't, I just, I can't, I'm sorry. I, I just got fine. It's not even the fucking line. Paula Widobro's cinematography in this episode is really good. One of my favorite shots in the whole show is this shot of Sally when she's doing her monologue. Her team is amazing. When I was in the wings, Barry's kind of freaking out. They're right there with you and they're like reacting. I just saw you go to a place tonight. I... Ah! Okay, I see you're still in that place. Ah! I can't remember what friend of yours showed up, but you had like the 48 hours of no sleep, makeup on, yeah. and somebody showed up and didn't realize he was in makeup and was like, oh my God, you look like shit. This show's taking it out of you, man. You gotta stop. <laughs> You're doing too many things, Bill. You're doing too many things. And I was like, this is makeup. From day to day no one to will ever off. know any, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I remember in the writer's room where we were talking about it. So Chris would come to Barry and um, and there was just a silence because we all kind of got to the same conclusion. It's like, he's gonna have to kill Chris. Jeez, all right. Yeah, I guess that's what he has to do. I always felt that Barry, he wants to go down the Chris Avenue, which is be a Marine who's married and has a kid. And he's afraid that he'll turn into this Taylor guy. He decides not to kill the bad version of himself. And because he does that, he's then put in a position where he has to kill the version of himself that he wants to be, I think. I didn't want to kill a Marine. I'm not going to kill a Marine. And because of that, now he has to kill the Marine. When I came home, she knew it. And then I lied to her, and I told her that I was, I, I was going to the gym. Chris Marquette, he was phenomenal. He would get himself so worked up that I would get nauseous because he's so freaked out. And then like any good actor, you say cut, and he'd be like, yeah, I'm gonna go to the Broncos, I think, or, you know, <laughs> or whatever. And then action, and he would do that. It's cool. I can keep quiet. I do like when Chris starts backtracking. He just realizes, oh, I'm in the car with a murderer. And, and he starts nobody backtracking. Nobody knows I'm here. Barry, I know you're a good guy. I'm a good guy, I kill the bad guys, and that's a thing you kind of hear people say to him throughout the season. It's like the mission creep of being a good guy, where it's like, I'm a good guy, and I'm just gonna do this one little thing, and then I'm gonna be a good guy, and then that one little thing yeah. makes him do something else, and it's like it just starts spiraling out of control. 